Family Week is an annual event organized by the Assemblies of God Church, Nigeria. The theme of this year is Reviving Our Family Altar Through Effectual Fervent Prayer. Some topics covered within the week include Reviving Our Family Altar, The Need for Family Altar, Challenges to Family Altar, Blessings of Family Altar, and practical suggestions that will be of great help to every family. However, Assemblies of God Church, number 28 Kadiri Street, Oba, Lagos State, decided to go an extra mile by organizing a family from fair on Saturday, 26th February, 2022. People were amused when they were informed that they were coming to church to play and enjoy themselves. However, it turned out to be fun. All forms of games find their ways to the church on that day. Lots of games were made available and people killed behind the games of their interests. Walt and Ludo won many converts, especially women, and they displayed their skills in the game as they happily ran one siki, two siki, and so on. Draft is a game for men. Good news men who have interest in it we are at their own corner doing their own thing. Football lovers, we are not left behind. The Gunners, the Blues, just to mention a few, queue behind their clubs in solidarity. Game Station was their life. Trust our boys. They don't disappoint in this area. Some group of girls pitch their tents with the game in their phone. They were seen playing their game and laughing freely. It was clear that they were enjoying themselves. Other games that graced the occasion were Scrabble, Monopoly, Chess, and Ayo. Ayo game topped this list in this section because many women were seen in different sections playing it. They thoroughly enjoyed themselves. The essence of the gathering is Jesus. The organizers of the program have this in mind. Little wonder that a gospel film was being projected. Film lovers organized themselves to watch it. Table tennis is a game loved majorly by the youths. Good news youths took turns to display the knowledge they had earlier acquired in the game. As these games were going on, small chops, granuts, Biscuits and other snacks accompanied it. Finally, it was time for item number seven. Hot spicy jello fries was served to rice lovers. White semo, accompanied with a delicious egusi soup, went to those who cared for swallow. Of course, assorted kinds of non-alcoholic drinks were made available to escort the food to its final destination. The icing on top of the cake was the arrival of the host minister, a man from God, Reverend Andrew Oyoma. It was not a day for long preaching, so he offered a fatherly advice to the congregants. He enjoyed them to prioritize the happiness of the members of the family, emphasizing that happiness is not costly. He enjoyed the members to visit an eatery at least once in a year with all the members of their family. According to him, even if it's only popcorn that they can afford to buy, no one would drive them away. He concluded by praying and showering blessings on the congregants. The family funfair has come and gone, but the good news members are still relishing the happy moment even as they await another well-packaged family from fair on or before 2023. And by the grace of God, it can only get better.